Hey guys, I'm here with um, my update on my No Spin November challenge. It is day two, November 2nd. Um, I'm doing really great. Of course, it's only the second day, so, you know, motivation is strong in the first week. Um, so I just wanted to let you guys know kind of what I've been doing today and yesterday. Um, last night we had um, bean burritos for dinner um, with stuff that we had on hand. And then um, tonight we're going to have vegetarian hot dogs um, roasted in the pan and then also um, some potatoes and broccoli with that. Um, just kind of sounded good to me. Um, for breakfast I had coffee and a protein bar and for lunch I had a can of light broccoli, uh, cream, cream of broccoli soup or broccoli cheddar soup with a scoop of unflavored protein, um, and that's all I've had today. Um, let's see, and as far as things to do, um, I'm going to be getting a free six-piece chicken nugget for my son um, after his school today, and that is free because um, McDonald's has deals. So if you sign up for the McDonald's app, not sponsored, I'm just trying to help you guys out, um, you can get deals and free items. Um, he doesn't always like them, so it's kind of nice to just have the stuff for free or for like a dollar. Um, and so today I will be, um, just a second, I'll show you what I'm doing. Okay, so one thing I'm doing is I'm going to redo my nails. These are Halloween nail strips, and they've lasted probably a week or more. Um, I just put them on and then I coat them with a Sally Hansen um, top coat and they stay for quite a while. Um, yeah, these are probably about a week judging by the grow out. So I'll show you what nail strips I'm looking at. Um, ones that I already have on hand. I really wanted to buy some new fall nails, but um, I'm not spending any money this month and I already have a bunch. So here are some of the nails that I have. These ones are hard to see because of, I've used some of them, but they're black and cream uh, and pink. So they're kind of neutral ones. These ones I love with the pink and leopard. These almost look black, but they're a really dark maroon. These ones are just um, transparent confetti. These ones are a black glitter confetti. These are more for Christmas. They're snowflakes or winter. And um, these are a transparent um, to go over top, just stripes. Well, let's see. These are some flowers. These are kind of nice for spring, I think. Probably won't wear those. Oh, I like these. These are, they almost look red, but they're pink. These ones are a red. They have a ten, tiny bit of orange to them. Um, these are all my Halloween nails. There's about 10 of them in there. They might last until next year if I keep them sealed. So, I'm not sure which one I'll decide. I'll come back and show you once I'm done. The other thing I have to get done today is my CPR. Um, this is for healthcare providers. It's not any kind of advanced CPR. It's just the basic that you need um, being any kind of nurse. Um, I think doctors need it too, CNAs, any kind of healthcare provider will need this basic, um, it's basic life support. So it covers children, um, including infants and older child and adults. It includes um, advanced airway and things like that. Um, eventually I would like to take some advanced cardiac life support, CPR, and a pediatric um, advanced life support as well. Um, but this is all I need for now. Just want to keep my licenses up to date and everything. So that'll take up my time and be something interesting. I always like keeping up to date and learning. So um, yeah, I think just 
um, keeping your free time busy during these no spin challenges is really important. Hey, sorry, I just wanted to talk um, so you could look at my face. Um, so s keeping yourself busy during these no spin challenges is really important um, because I think something kind of fun for a lot of us is shopping and looking around at things. Um, so just filling up your free time if you do have any is helpful and just trying to find the joy in things like, you know, I could be kind of grumpy about having to renew my CPR um, license or certification, whatever you call it, but I'm not because um, it's kind of interesting to me to see what updates they always have and um, this class is going to be online, but then there is a portion that you have to go in and actually talk to the instructor and show them that you know what you're doing. Um, that's very important, obviously, um, not just the books part of it, but that in a real life event that you remember and you have the right technique because the technique is very important, actually, um, for the heart to be able to circulate the blood when you are doing chest compressions, which is the most important part. Um, and then things like me changing out my nails. Um, you know, it's always fun for me to buy new nail strips, so of course I would like to. And I found some super cheap on Amazon for only like eight or $10 for um, maybe 10 sets of nails that I could wear throughout the whole fall up until um, Christmas, you know, so I could wear it all this month and even change it once a week or more. But um, I'm going to use what I have and just be happy with it and excited that I'm saving a little bit of money. So just be happy with what you have and use what you have. Um, so I will show you my nails when I get those done and maybe I'll show you the free chicken nuggets when we get them. Um, I don't know how to record like a screen record on my phone so I can't show you like what it shows on the app but just download the app on McDonald's and go to the deals and rewards. Okay. Knowledge and confidence levels. Using intelligent software. Here's what my son's having after school. We got free chicken nuggets and some M&Ms from trick-or-treating. All right, here is our dinner for today, Tuesday, November 2nd. Um, second day of the challenge, no spin challenge. Um, this is what my son's having. So we're having mashed potatoes, broccoli, and vegetarian um, hot dog sausages. So my son is having the leftovers of some grapes that are kind of on their last leg. I wanted to use them up. Um, he's also going to have a little bit of what we're having. I doubt he'll eat it, but I do like to serve it to him to see if he'll eat it. He's three years old, so. Um, he likes these protein waters. I didn't like them, but he found them in the cupboard and wanted them, and turns out that he likes them. Um, so to not let those go to waste, um, there's my plate. I have a bunch of olives on there too. I might not eat all of them, but um, potatoes and broccoli and the hot dogs, and there's my husband's, and he will be having um, some soda with his drink, some seltzer water with his meal, I mean. Okay, that's it. Okay guys, I think that's everything for today. I'm going to wrap this video up and I'll start another one tomorrow. Um, let me know if there's anything else that you would like to see during this no spin challenge. Um, I'm happy to vlog other parts of my day. Just let me know. And maybe I'll try to come up with some more tips um, for how you can stay on your no spin challenge if you are choosing to do that with me. Thanks, see you next time.